Price 8. Huh? What are we about to go do? Uh, Have a family friendly time. Oh, I mean, get pizza. We're about to go get pizza. We're going to get pizza. Yeah. We're going to go to the uh, most Swedish place that we can think of. I'm going to leave that as a surprise. Mm -hmm. We'll be pulling up there soon. Wow. That place looks very interesting. Very big. We just found a... Uh... Yeah. So this has to be a mall. Awesome. Okay. Looks like we're about to go explore another Swedish mall. Is the pizza in the mall? Probably. Probably in the mall. Oh, okay. I'm assuming up. I'm gonna ruin the surprise. We're looking for a pizza hut and uh, <laughs> we can't find it. This is a huge mall. I've had at least five people comment on the last few videos saying or uh, asking if we're gonna get anything besides burgers. So <laughs> yes, we cooked those to heart. We are getting pizza this time. Thank you guys very much. <laughs> Only the most authentic Swedish food. Yes, only the most authentic, you know, from Pizza Hut, because that's that's how we do it. So, yeah. To be fair, we've had some, like, local places. Like, we had that brisket place. Yes. We had the sushi place. Yes. Uh, local burger place. Yeah, Those we're just... Burgers, but. Hey, hey, we're just getting haters, man. Haters are to be expected. Granted, not from my family, which is where all the hate's coming from, but... Okay, there you go. Thank you. <laughs> Thank, Thank you so much. Thank you. Have a nice weekend. You as well. You all right, back to the car. Should be a fun venture. Let's go see how Swedish Pizza Hut is. Bryce, what's your review? Swedish Pizza Hut. It's pretty good. Pretty good? Mm -hmm. Compared to regular Pizza Hut. I haven't had regular Pizza Hut in like years, so. Okay, that's fair. Looks fantastic though. 10 out of 10. Bryce, hey, right. what are we about to go do? We're going to we go a lake. We're going to go find the lake. We're going to lake. Yeah. Yeah. Let's do it. Yeah. All right. Here we go. <laughs> I haven't shown this part yet, but uh, we have like a little outdoor area to this Airbnb, which is pretty cool. We have not hung out here yet. We still have, um, I think, 20 something days to do so. So that'll have to get added to the list. But yeah. All right, we're gonna go walk over to the lake. We got distracted, we found a hiking trail. <laughs> All in all, I could not be happier that we made the Sweden trip happen. This is amazing. Everything over here is just so authentic and beautiful. Side note, I just realized my cardio has gone to crap over the past few. Yeah, Ooh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's not even, this is like hardly even a hike. Ooh, okay. Yeah, I'll count that as a good view. <laughs> <laughs> water. Wow. For something. There's the lake. Or I wonder if that. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that yeah, yeah, that's it because the road curves around. Very cool. I'm going to go a little higher. Wow. Look at that. Bryce has got to be getting some good pictures with his DSLR right now. We found the lake. This is pretty close to our Airbnb. It's nice how close it is. We're going to go uh, keep walking around it, see what else, what else is over here. We just stumbled upon this here tree. There's a rope swing. Bryce got a video of me doing that. I'm gonna throw that in there. Oh, you didn't, you didn't fall. That was anticlimactic. <laughs> I'm not doing this to flex. I'm doing this to show you guys how to be a decent human being. Okay. Easy as that. We just found a community hot tub. We're gonna go chill in that for a little bit. Supposedly they close at eight, but uh, the Google also says they close at six, so we'll see. So that was a little sad. We just, uh, we got here and we noticed that the only person in the quote unquote hot tub was a little kid. So we ended up translating this sign and it says, uh, that's a small pool, not a hot tub. So sad days, definitely sad days. Yo, what is up, people? It is the next day. Sorry uh, for the skip. We didn't end up doing all that much yesterday, but uh, 
essentially all that you missed out on was uh, our Airbnb host. They invited us in for a, um, a night of drinking coffee and wine and watching a bunch of YouTube together and talking about life. It was honestly probably one of the coolest nights of my life. Yep. Yeah, it was a... Uh, it doesn't get much better than that. That was by far the most adult thing I've ever done, and it was so cool getting to uh, connect with, like, I don't know, I, I don't know how else to say it, but just real sweets. That was very yeah. cool. Yeah. yeah. So, uh, yeah, uh, they invited us for more nights like that, and it should be a good time. We are uh, really grateful to be staying in this Airbnb. Yep. And uh, yeah, today though, we just went into that uh, cafe. We got some breakfast, some coffee, and now we're going to a Saturday market because, uh, yeah. So we just pulled up to the Saturday market. By the looks of it, it looks pretty small, but we'll see. See if they have anything cool. Very nice. Oh, we gotta go to that. That one was pretty cool. We're gonna go find some more. There's uh, There seems to be a good amount of Saturday markets over in this area, so. So surprise, surprise, we stumbled upon another mall. Uh, we're trying to find an art store right now. So I'm really determined to buy some art while I'm here and uh, we're trying to find an art store. We've been having little luck so far because Google said that there is a, uh, there's an art store in that mall. There's definitely not an art store in that mall. When I say we have been having no luck finding an art gallery, we have been having no luck. Google says we are currently at one and uh, it doesn't really look like one. Does not look like one. This more looks like a condo. Seventh try is a charm. We just found one. We, uh, we had to drive to it, but we're about to walk in. Oh. So that place was beautiful, but uh, those were all prints. I'm looking for paintings, but still very, very, very cool. Happy we finally found something like that. Yeah. Yeah. Ooh, this is cool. We've given up on the hunt for art today, and we are now looking for a hammock. But uh, they don't really sell hammocks in camping stores, we have noticed, so we're trying to find anywhere that'll sell one. Enjoyed some uh, super gourmet McDonald's. Yeah. Very gonna, nice. Very nice. Now we're gonna go chill at the Airbnb. Fun stuff. Yo, what is up, YouTube? Welcome to the end of this vlog. I appreciate you guys so much for watching. Uh, I know it's been a bit of a jump since that last clip, but uh, since then we just came home. We uh, we got some food. We are currently watching a bunch of movies on Netflix. It's pretty fun. What are we watching right now, Bryce? I honestly don't remember what it's called. <laughs> oh, We're the Millers. Oh, We're the Millers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a good one. I'm loving this. It's a really funny one. But uh, yeah, uh, our Airbnb host, Christer, he invited us back into his home again tonight, and it was awesome. He uh, he invited us to join him in a, uh, I forget the name of it, but it's a Swedish tradition where in the yeah. summer they have a, a, a crawfish dinner. Yeah, and it was, Yeah, in August. It was uh, really cool. It's... I, I cannot convey just how awesome it is getting to spend time with him. And uh, yeah, we are very grateful to have him as a host. And uh, his girlfriend, Hannah, is really cool. So uh, yeah, we're really enjoying our time over here in Sweden. We are really looking forward to uh, our experiences to come and everything that we have to look forward to. It should be a good time. Uh, thank you so much for watching, though. I'm going to go ahead and end this video. I will see you in the next one. Peace. Obama. Obama. <laughs>